Emporia State that went into the jungle, as they call it, and beat the Pittsburgh State Gorillas, something we have just not seen a lot from Pittsburgh State playing in their home venue. And this one, I mean, we're going to talk quite a bit about it because this game was absurd. Emporia State certainly showed out in this one. So at the start of the contest, excuse me as I get that full screen, shout out to uh, KOAM Channel 7 there for the great footage on this one. In the start here, Emporia State, only three points in the first quarter. They go into halftime, though, up 17-7, to and a big reason for that, we've talked a little bit about Gunnar Gundy. He was 26 for 40 on the night, 217 and two touchdowns. His number one target, though, right there, Tyler Common, he had eight catches for 129 yards and two touchdowns. You're going to see a lot of those connections from those guys. And then uh, Pittsburgh State did have some things going, would have a touchdown early on, and you're seeing see a couple highlights from the Gorillas there. Here's a field goal attempt that I believe, if I'm not mistaken, was wide, and I would be correct in saying that. They were missing their starting kicker, kicker, excuse me, down in Pittsburgh State. That seemed to be a big piece of this one. Another deep ball, this time back in the end zone. Common got that one. He had himself a night. I talked about it already a little bit. We'll keep rolling with it. And you go into halftime, ESU, 17-7, to no points scored in the third quarter from either team. Defense is pretty dialed in. In the fourth quarter, some more scoring happens. Emporia State ends up taking this one. They went up 24-14 with five minutes to go in the game, and uh, that would be shaken a little bit. Three and a half minutes. Dodson throws a pass to Jack Roberts for the uh, the touchdown, excuse me. So they brought it within a three-point game, but just could not capitalize to close things off. It looks like their last possession, they turned the ball over on downs uh, after four plays. So a great stop by the Emporia defense to shut down Pittsburgh State. And uh, uh, that's a, a game that is really could be we talk about program defining wins for Emporia State. They've been a team that's been on that middle to upper echelon of the MIAA. That is a statement win for the Hornets. A very impressive one at that. Mm-hmm.